Hi there, so we're in my truck. Uh, as you well know what that means, I have an appointment today. So um, it's just a check in with uh, my nutritionist. Um, I had my blood work done last week to see where my iron levels and everything are. I'm actually running a little bit behind, so I'm gonna make this intro really quick. Um, I'm hoping to be released from the clinic today um, where they don't need follow up care. And um, then I can move on to my skin removal surgery. So uh, as always, I'll sneak you in to try uh, for my um, weight. And uh, yeah, I will see you when we get out. So in kilograms, it's 77.2. And in pounds, it is 170.3. Hi there, so I'm back. Uh, had a good appointment. Um, I don't know how to feel about my appointment. Uh, the blood work came back. All my levels have steadily gone up. Uh, my iron and my hemoglobin are still low. Um, so I need to take some vitamin D with it to help absorb. Um, so I'm gonna start doing that. Um, but I've been released from the clinic. Um, I don't know why this makes me as emotional as it does. Uh, I think it's just such a long road that you now that it's over I'm like wow <laughs> you know when you're sitting waiting for your surgery and going to all these appointments it's very frustrating and you feel like it's never gonna end and it's never gonna get better and it's never gonna be you know anything but this big pain in the ass but now that I'm on the other side it's weird you know it, it's like the safety net's gone <laughs> I don't know why this makes me so emotional it just does but um, of course the clinic has said that if I need them all I gotta do is call of course uh, if I find that something's going wrong or something doesn't feel right or if I'm having pain or sickness or whatever but I'm done I'm um, they have referred me for skin removal surgery here in Canada, um, but the wait list for that is ridiculously long. So I think I'm going to start journaling that journey now that I've been released from the clinic. I think um, it's time for me to start the other side of the journey with the skin removal. But, you know, I never thought I'd be upset about not having to come here anymore. But, you know, like... Joanne is my nurse, Lee is my nutritionist, um, Dr. Kanji did my surgery, but prior to that I met with Dr. Birch for my surgeries. Um, these people, you know, you trust them with your in innermost details, like you're telling them all the crap that you don't share with people, like dumping syndrome, whether you cheated, you know, they're looking at your tracker, they know you at, like no other person does in my opinion for medical professionals because they know all your dirty little secrets and you form this weird bond with them like I've called Lee a bully a Nazi uh, oh god I've called him all kinds of things usually centered around my coffee because he always was taking my coffee away but today when I was leaving the clinic I actually hugged him and thanked him because his guidance for eating and for how to portion and how to get the nutrients I needed, it was instrumental in my success, right? So, you know, to the Edmonton Weight Wise Clinic, you guys are doing great work. And although we get frustrated and we get angry with you and frustrated and angry with ourselves, you know, what you're doing is saving lives and saving self-esteem. Like it's, and I thank every one of you for, you know, and, you know, I didn't see much of my surgeon. I, the surgeon's almost incidental to this journey. You know, the, the, everybody talks about seeing the surgeon, but these other people are really what make it for you to make it successful. So thank you so much. And uh, anyway, I don't know if any of them watch my videos, but whatever. Um, so... Uh, yeah, today is kind of an interesting day. It's my birthday today. Um, so kind of an interesting present that I'm being released from the clinic on my birthday. And now I'm off to the dentist to have dental work because nobody knows how to party like me. So uh, I'm off to the dentist and um, 
yeah, I will post my next video about my steps for skin removal surgery soon. So, uh, motivation is a choice, not a feeling. Bye, guys.